Hi there, someone uh, PM'd me and asked me a bit about this Uptime Robot, so I thought I'd just do a quick video for you guys if it's of uh, help, great. Um, once you've registered, it's fairly straightforward, you can actually uh, monitor up to 50 different websites. Now, I used to use Jetpack, but I found that Jetpack overall tends to bloat WordPress and slow it down, and speed is really of the essence as far as SEO is concerned if you're working on that side of it. Um, so what I decided to do was, to, and I've used the Uptime Robot for some of these other websites for quite some time. It, they're all in one place, and you've got you know the historical data as well. So firstly, you go to Settings, and you add your time zone. <coughs> Excuse me. You can also get SMS credits if you want to upgrade, but uh, I don't bother with that. I've used RSS notifications. You literally click on this link. It'll give you a... Uh, URL that you then put into your RSS feeder and it, what I found recently actually I, I uh, in Google I added this uh, RSS feeder so in Google Chrome sorry I've added this and I've got the quick start challenge and uptime robot but you simply just click on that link paste in your the code that it gives you here and just so there you see take the URL copy it and then it shows that I'm already following it but basically that's what you do then click on follow here and then tick and it'll then it'll feed you that information it'll also send you emails if you if you uh, want it to all right so where's the what have I done I lost myself here right so once you've done the settings you go to your, your dashboard and then your information is is here and you can simply just add your websites by clicking on add new monitor so you can choose you can actually register keywords um, but I tend to use it just for this tracking so you add a friendly name in here put your URL in choose how often you want it to monitor to be fair I mean if it's a really busy website then you want it as often as possible so a couple of the sites that I'm actually pro, uh, work in progress, I tend to set them for 120 minutes. And then once I launch them and I'm promoting them, then I'll drop it down to uh, five. Uh, I've already, as I said to you, got the RSS feed, but you also uh, can have it sent to you by your, your email. You literally just click on uh, create monitor and you can then add up your, your 50 there or as many websites as you as you want. And, and that's it really, it's fairly straightforward. If you want to look at individual ones, for example, um, you can see last seven days, this is one I've just added, and as well, so there you go. So it shows you the, the individual data for it, and then your dashboard just shows you, the, shows you all of them. Okay, if you've got any questions, I'm happy to answer them, just let me know, just, Pop a note in the link below or PM me and I'll do what I can to help. Good luck.